Well, it's time for all the sport tonight with Brandon Cook. Get your fill of the action. STV Sport, sponsored by Papa John's. A very good evening to you. Now, it's day one of the Open Championship and I'm afraid to say it's not been a good start for Robert McIntyre. He's currently three over par through 12 holes. One man who has impressed those, South Africa's Louis Oosthuizen. He's the clubhouse leader on six under par. Here's Ronnie Charters. On the team. Now to football and Dundee United defender Ryan Edwards says the club's vision made it easy for him to commit his future to Tannadice. It comes as the 27-year-old put pen to paper on a new two-year deal. Here's Stephanie Daly. As the sun shone in St Andrews today, in Stephanie Daly, STV News. Rugby now and Stuart Hogg returns to captain the Lions for their match against DHL Stormers on Saturday. Warren Gatlin's side suffered their first defeat of the tour last night, losing 17-13 to South Africa. Hogg is back after his period of self-isolation. Yeah, look, it was challenging at times, um, but a little kind of mini-isolation group. We had a, a good bit of crack along the way and, and kept, each other, kept each other going, so... Uh, I wouldn't wish that my worst enemy, honestly. It was, it was a horrendous few days, but as I say, I'm delighted to be back. And finally to tennis, and Jamie Murray will now be at the Olympics in Tokyo. Murray was initially overlooked, but following the withdrawal of Dan Evans after he tested positive for COVID, the Scot will now be on the flight to Japan. And we wish him all the very best and all the other Team GB athletes all the very best of luck when the Games begin a week tomorrow. Can you believe it? It's only a year late. That's all from me this evening.